tell for the first son and the camera here what you said about the labyrinth going in. So the labyrinth is, is this device that's actually been found on the oldest prehistoric carvings in uh, actually in Cornwall um, on these prehistoric stones. So it's like hundreds of thousands of years old. But essentially the point is that a labyrinth is different to a maze. A maze is like the mind. It has confusion, it has de dead ends. You can get lost. You can have to start again. Whereas a labyrinth, every step you take on a labyrinth will lead you closer to understanding. But the principle is when you walk a labyrinth, why it's actually for a human to walk is that when you walk through it, you basically drop anything that requires you to hold on to it. So either something that you think is good and you feel like I've got to hold on to it or something that you feel is negative and you've got to hold on to the suffering so it doesn't happen again. So as you walk, you basically just, what am I holding on to? And you drop it. What am I holding on to? Drop it. And you get to the middle and you feel this relief. What happens is that you you don't you don't pick up the thing again. What you do is you have gratitude for each of the things. So you remember it. You have gratitude for it. In that, the gratitude dissolves the glue gratitude of of, of, yeah. of the holding. It, mm -hmm. As it separates out, you get the wisdom, and then you pick up the wisdom, and is the energy that you infuse back into you. So that by the time oh. you're out, you've dropped all the story, but you've gained all the wisdom. Yes, and the wisdom. Gain through the gratitude. That's my idea anyway. Right. Yes. But who really knows? <laughs>